How's it going, Cal U? I'm student meteorologist Alex McElroy here in the Cal U Weather Studio, and I'll be giving a forecast for this week. So starting off, we're gonna look at some current temperatures. We see about 60 degrees and very mild for this time of year in Pittsburgh. We see about 82 degrees in Miami, Florida, and 32 degrees where there are some snow showers right now in Denver, Colorado. So going into the radar, we're gonna be seeing this huge line of rain from the Great Lakes all the way down to Alabama here. We can see this right here on the radar. And let's zoom into our area and look at what we can expect for the future radar. So we're gonna be seeing these showers pass through between two and three o'clock today. And there's gonna be some thunderstorms that pop up for later tonight around maybe eight o'clock. There you can see the thunderstorms moving their way in. That's for 715. So they should hit about eight o'clock, nine o'clock tonight. So going into some watches and warnings now, we're gonna look at the Southeast. So we're turning this on. We're gonna look at the Southeast, the radar first and then I'll turn on the watches and warnings. So they actually had some severe thunderstorm warnings and tornado watches issued this morning down here in Alabama and Mississippi, as we can see that as evidence right there, we see that severe thunderstorm and turning on the warnings, we see National Weather Service issued a severe thunderstorm warning and also hail warnings and watches for that region. So going on to what we can expect for this week and today, Today, tomorrow, and this weekend is today we see these, this rain pass through about 3 o'clock and then the severe thunderstorms coming through tonight into our region. This system will progress, move its way off to the northeast. And then for the southeast, we saw evidence of those severe thunderstorms that are happening currently right now. They will have the cold front pass through and then have less mild air coming in behind that. So looking at for tomorrow, Friday, we're going to see this cold front pass through after these rain showers pass through, and this will bring colder air and perhaps a mixing of precipitation for this weekend. Looking at the Midwest and Northern United States, we see this uh, jet coming through, dipping down all the way from Canada. We see this Canadian Arctic air moving its way down, which will progress its way into our region. So as we see, as I've answered that right here, it progresses its way into our region. It'll make it very cold for this weekend below normal temperatures and we can see this mixed precipitation but out in the midwest we see this warmer air creating a ridge so for the start of next week we are going to see these unseasonably cold temperatures even 20 10 to 20 degrees below normal for this time of year and that will put a damper on some of the plans for this weekend so well, as i said it's going to be pretty warm until that cold front passes through tomorrow night into saturday creating these colder temperatures for this weekend we could see about high of 46 only on sunday which is variable and normal and then even in the next tuesday we're only going to see about 42 with unseasonably cold temperatures moving into the next wednesday it should warm up a little bit for the later part of next week i'm student meteorologist alex mcavoy now back to ryan and zach at the desk